All right, guys. Today, this one's just going to be a little bit of discussion, a little bit of catch up, so to speak. Talk about why my videos have been so sporadic lately, what's been going on, and when I can possibly get back to normal for all of that stuff. So, got a lot of big things going on right now. I am getting our house ready to sell. That's eating up a ton of my time. I also have been back and forth to Tennessee a few times now, looking at property. We did ultimately purchase property in Tennessee. So I will be moving. That is, that is another huge thing to throw on top of this as well as trying to get the property in Tennessee set up. So, I have been back and forth to Tennessee a few times recently. That alone ate up a ton of my time. Finishing up the stuff that I had been remodeling on the house, as well as painting, getting rid of things, any of you that have moved, sold the house, you know exactly what I'm talking about. On top of that, still have regular work to do, my normal job. Still, still have my second job, doing all different kinds of floor work. So you guys can see how this is really eaten into any kind of free time that I have. Now, in the past, for those of you that are newer or just don't know, testing something like this right here to make the two videos you've seen, I have almost 10 hours worth of time into everything to do with this one particular knife, for example. Same with the Spy 27. Yeah, it's, this one's a little bit more drawn out because I did do the carry with it and everything like that. But you, you guys, you get the point. A quick test on a knife, I'll definitely have over seven hours into it once all is said and done. The cutting, the sharpening, the video time, the editing, and all that stuff. Doesn't seem like it would take that much time until you actually do it. And before you know it, you've got a pile of time wrapped up into everything. So in the past, I usually did somewhere between 20 and 25 hours worth of time just for the channel. In the past. Some weeks more, some weeks less. It's, it's definitely been less lately. Some of what you're going to see for this one... I did 10 days ago or so. Still have to film some for this. I did also start the K390. That, that footage that I have already is probably three weeks old or so, maybe more. So that's what's going on. If you want to stick around at the very end, when I'm done, I may throw in a clip. The only video I took was the view from the front of my property and a little bit of the front of the property, but it's it's just woods pretty much. So once I do get moved and get my house sold in the next month, month and a half, I'm going to have even more work to do there. I have a lot of things to set up gonna have to set up where we're gonna be living gonna have to build a lot of things gonna have to get a shop set up a storage set up it's just gonna be a ton of work so I'm not sure how much longer my video posting is going to be sporadic hopefully sooner than later I can go ahead and get it done I'm not positive though. I do have enough things in the works 
and I have a few loaners that I need to finish up here in the next week or so. Also have some mods to show you guys that I've done and taken footage of over the past month and a half, two months. I'll splice those into a video also. So that's where I'm currently at. Like I said, this is going to be a really short video. If you guys have any questions, comments, anything like that. And for anybody who did send me loaners, you guys will get your stuff back before I move. I'm not taking any more at this time. So I'm just going to finish up what I do have and get them back. It's not very many. What do I have coming up? Like I said, the Z-Wear is going to be coming out right after this video. Do have another video. My conclusion on Spy 27. How long I ended up carrying it. How the edge is now after carrying it for that amount of time. I'm not currently working on anything in particular for carry. I have been carrying the K390 Endura pretty much exclusively since I stopped the Spy 27. I'll go ahead and give you guys a hint. Seki did a very good job on this. I'm super happy with it. Absolutely love carrying this. And I made you kind of an update on this one. This has pretty much become my default work beater. Really like this thing. Love how the 154CM does. Not a big fan of Tantos, except for a work knife where I find them to be extremely useful. And I'm not even, not a huge auto person either, but I don't even mind that this is an automatic. So those are those are some things coming up. Do have some other stuff. I'll just go ahead and let that be surprised. I've teased some of it. Gonna have some of my sharks from Alex Steingraber. Gonna have some tests on those coming up soon too because I did start on three of the four of those. And he also sent me some other testers to do a ton of testing on. So... That stuff will be coming up. It may be sporadic. I don't know. Nothing I can do about it at this point. But that's all I have for this one. As always, I appreciate your time. And thanks for watching.